Welcome back. A new University of Minnesota study says greener does not necessarily mean cleaner when it comes to electric cars. That's especially true if the electricity used to charge the car is coal generated. The energy from that method creates more than three and a half times more soot. It also leads to more smog-related deaths compared to gas-powered cars. But critics say the study does not factor in the government's bid to use less coal. The Green Car reports as recharging cars using natural gas cuts pollution and health issues by half. And if the power comes from wind, water or wave energy, air pollution deaths are reduced by 75%. Well, after three months of weaker output, the U.S. auto industry boosted production by more than 5% last month. CCTV's Bianca Davy has more on what's moving the industry forward. 2014 has been a productive year for U.S. factories. A new report by the Federal Reserve shows manufacturing output has risen almost 5% over the past year. Economists say car makers and their American customers are driving much of that growth. The U.S. auto industry posted its best November sales numbers in a decade. We're expecting to end 2014 with about 16.4 million sales. Uh, so we're getting back to that pre-recession peak that we saw of about 17 million units. And uh, the fundamentals are strong in the automotive industry. We're seeing it lead the economic recovery in the U.S. market overall. Economists say the auto sector owes its growth to a healthier labor market and greater consumer confidence. More affordable loans and lower gasoline prices are making people more comfortable with big ticket purchases, including cars. Cheaper fuel has also sparked a shift in the type of car consumers are buying. Industry insiders say new SUVs and pickup trucks are once again catching the eyes of U.S. shoppers. But according to some car executives, a drop in gasoline prices has forced them to rethink their short-term production strategies after years of focusing on hybrids and electric vehicles. Despite those concerns, the U.S. auto industry is on track for a sixth straight year of growth. Sales are expected to rise 4.5% in 2014. But economists warn the momentum can't last forever. They say in order to continue, automakers will need to win over a new generation of car buyers. Bianca Davy, CCTV.